Hey guys, welcome to my new video. My name is Brian Sanchez and today I'm gonna do a quick review on the new Dogger X from EC Tattooing. As I always say, I talk about three aspects, pros, cons, and price. That for me is the most important thing when you're trying to get a new machine. I'm gonna show you first what is inside the box. So, this is the machine super small machine i have been using this machine for at least two three weeks and i think it's a really really good machine it's really comfortable and there is something special about this machine and it's made with rubber paint so the sensation is really really interesting and the machine is really comfortable and the rubber paint helps you a lot to reduce the vibration about about when you're working so there is a couple of good things that I like about this machine. The first thing is like the rubber paint, that is really funny and interesting. And the other thing is like, you can see what is inside the machine. That is something that happened with many of the EC machines. And I like that because I can see how the machine works, right? So this is the motor. It's a super small motor. It's like a direct motor. This is the, the bar and I, I like it. So you can see how the machine works and you can keep it clean and keep it working. The other thing is like always, the machines always come with um, extra things like the O-rings that help you to keep your machine working. You know where the O-rings be here to keep the grip working and soft okay and the other good thing is like the EC tattoo machines come with the RCA cord so there is no many machines that come with the with the RCA cord and an extra cartridges that is always good to have new cartridges so I'm gonna show you there is something important about this machine and it's like it's not a con but it's like something that you have to know is like you need to have a good power supply because the machine runs in nine volts eight to ten for shading and nine to eleven for lining so you need a good power supply because a shitty power supply is not gonna run and uh, it's not gonna run in eight volts so I'm gonna show you how the machine, how quiet and how soft is the vibration on the machine. Now I have 10 volts and you can see it's, it's really comfortable. I like how comfortable and how small is the machine. I'm running in nine and 10 volts right now. This is a imitation hand. And you can see, you can you can hear how quiet is the machine. Okay, and right now it's 11 volts. That is supposed to be for uh, for lining. And the vibration is really really low, and the rubber paint is really good. Okay, so in the price about this machine, this machine is $369. So it's really, really affordable. And I think it's a really good machine. I recommend you to use this machine, uh, but you need to have a really good power supply if you want to have this machine. Uh, so, uh, oh, the stroke is 3.5, is the average stroke. Uh, Please let me know if you have any comment, if you have been using this machine. Please let me know what you think and I hope you like it. I hope you like this review. It's really quiet because it's really quick review because I think that's the most important thing. Just the price, the pros and the cons, right? So let me know what you think and see you next time. Thank you very much.